Hello guys, welcome to Online Web Tutor. I am Sanjay. We are learning Laravel 8 Framework Tutorial. This is our part number 62. Inside this video, we will see a CRUD application demo. From the next video, we will create such type of CRUD application. So in the last videos, we had discussed several types of basic concepts in Laravel 8 application. So if I back to browser, go here and this is our running application. As you can see, this is the default landing page. Now where is the CRUD application? So simply, if I go into this URL and type device. Now as you can see that we have a list devices page. Inside this page, also we have a add device button. Inside this tabular format, here we have an IT column, device name, status and action. Now click on this add device. So now here we have a form. Inside this form, we have few input elements in which we need to pass device name and status. So let's say that we want to create device 1. We are adding to our database. Status is active. Click on submit. And here device added successfully. And as we can see that inside this table format, now we have a single row data. Again, if we click on this button, let's create one more device. Device 2. Status is inactive. Click on submit. Now inside this table, we have second row data, which is status equal to inactive. Again, if we go click on add device, let's add one more device. So device 3 active submit and device added successfully so here we have the list inside this list here we have the action button in which we can perform the functionalities of edit and delete so let's say that we want to edit this device one information so i'm clicking on edit button and here the pre-filled information of device one so here we have the device one means the name and the status so let's say that we want to make it as inactive and also I want to change the name of device. So let's say device one updated. Click on submit. So device updated successfully. And as we can see that the name has been changed and the status is turned from active to inactive. Again, after some cases, we don't want this device to means we want to delete from this table. So we need to click on this delete button. Here is a confirmation that I want to delete the OK. So after clicking on OK button, now as you can see, device deleted successfully and the device too has been removed from this list as well as deleted from the database. So this is a simple CRUD application. From the next video, we will create such type of application. So behind the scene, we are operating with a resource controller. In the last video, we had discussed the concept of resource controller in which we have few methods. So by the help of those methods and resource routes, we are operating this CRUD application. And also, in the database perspective, we have a devices table and inside this devices table, we are storing the information of IT if I click on browse. And here inside this table, as we can see, we have IT column, name column and status column. So when we do any entry like by the clicking on add device, so the data will go inside this table. When we delete, when we update, data is operating basically from this devices table. So for this table, we have a migration, means we have a migration file, we have a model and a resource controller. And one more thing, while going through this application means when we will create, then we will see a concept of method spoofing in Laravel 8. So this is the simplest video of demonstration of CRUD, means CRUD application. So from the next video, we will create and see all the concepts. So for this video session guys, thank you for watching and have a great day.